Yahoo, YouTube. I am super ganky. And today, start of the day, we're going to talk about making mistakes and not letting them become a part of your identity. I am super ganky. That's my identity. And I'm trying to form good habits to model that identity after. But forming good habits is not as easy as you might think it would be. Something I've learned in the past couple of weeks is that this, this, this image of identity is so, so, so important. And if you make a mistake, it's okay. That is what we tend to think about the process. You know, our old identity says, you know what, it's okay if we make a mistake, everybody makes mistakes. I'll just keep going along the journey. Yeah, the process is going to keep going. Yeah, 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 no. If we make mistakes along this new process and we internalize the mistakes, we're going to associate our old selves with our new self. And I feel like that is what really stops people from getting the motivation and the inspiration and seeing the results in the process they're taking, in the process they're making. Internalizing the mistakes they make along the journey. If you're making mistakes along this new journey, you're probably falling off the journey and going back to the old one. You have to seek to want to, what's it called, not make the mistakes. And if you do, don't accept them as a part of your new identity. Because if you accept the old mistakes as a part of your new identity, you're going to lose momentum, you're going to lose focus, you're going to lose energy to be walking down that path consistently. This weekend, I fell off the path entirely. I didn't do Twitch, I didn't write, I didn't do YouTube, I didn't do anything. I just was like... I want to be normal. I had this idea of it. I wanted to be normal this weekend and it's just so not me. Do I want to internalize this stuff along my journey? No, I don't want to do this because I understand that in order to form a new identity, in order to perceive reality with a positive perception, you really do need to define yourself. And if I were to let these things boil up, and they have already boiled up. I mean, they've boiled up my whole life. That's the old perception of myself. If I were to let them to boil up in the new identity, I wouldn't make any progress. And that's literally the most frustrating thing in my life right now, is that I just can't wake up at five o'clock in the morning and get up at five o'clock in the morning. That's literally the one thing, the one thing I want the most is just to get up when I wake up and get to work. That's the only thing I want. I don't want money, I don't want success, I don't want fame. I just wanna be able to wake up on time and get to work. Literally, that's where I'm at today. And the old me is getting in the way. The old me is getting in the way, making the mistakes is getting in the way because every day when I get up and I wake up, I'm like, ah, oh, you know, I could just, I could sleep a little more. It doesn't really matter, man. I guess it's whatever. I'll just get up tomorrow, blah, blah. There's no guarantee that tomorrow's gonna come around. There's no guarantee that you're gonna be able to do this stuff tomorrow. And I can tell you this, man, it is, it is so, 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 so frustrating. So guys, girls, ladies, gentlemen, people learn from mistakes, right? But they don't have to be your own mistakes. You can learn from other people's mistakes. These are my mistakes that I'm making that I'm trying to help get into your idea if you want to be more positive, if you want to form better habits for yourself because I'm trying to do the same thing and I'm failing every single day to do this. So take it, learn from it, grow from it, do this stuff. Yes, you can. Say it out loud. Believe it. Get Genki. If you like this video, don't forget to smash that like button. The likes really help me out. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Trying to get to 10,000 by the end of 2020. We got a lot of time left, but it's going to be hard. Leave a comment because I love responding to your comments with Genki energy and positivity. But most importantly, share this video with your friends. We need to get the good word of positive thinking out there to as many people as possible. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.